Hi, welcome back again to this LibreOffice tutorial, LibreOffice step by step. We want to talk about creating styles, updating styles, unloading styles from another document. We have this document with a heading 1, heading 2, and some text. And let's create a new heading 1, a new heading 2 and some text of course we don't like the document in this moment but we want to change that let's uh, check the default heading 1 heading 2 okay so we have this document but we don't like we don't like the text is not justified we don't like how the heading 1 is looking how the heading 2 is looking we want to change everything we want to talk about these three tools here and we have to create a new style from here okay so it's the same thing uh, from here or from here for example we want 22 size and we want another color and we want also not center uh, let's I want more space here this is how I want to look the heading one so I can create a new style, new style from selection or pressing here and I have to enter a name, my heading 1, okay, you can see on the right I have that style. Now I want to change the look for heading 2, I don't like this, how it's looking now, I want to change something. Mm -hmm. Let's change the size to 18 and let's create a new style named my heading to. Okay, we have heading 1, heading 2. Now we have to align the text. Select the text. I want to be justify and let's change a little bit in this paragraph I want for the line to have one centimeter here and 1.15 space okay this is how I want to be the paragraph so I create a new style my paragraph Now I want to set the order. After heading 1 will come heading 2, after heading 2 will come my text. So let's uh, change that. After my heading, after my heading will come my heading 2. Apply. OK. After my heading 2 will come, my heading 2 will come, next style will be my paragraph. OK. So now let's select. Uh, let's go here to see just the custom styles. So I have all three styles I created. I have heading 1, heading 2 and text. But from now on, if I'm creating a new um, heading, for example this, new heading, if I select, if I select it, my heading 1, and pressing enter the next style will be my heading 2 okay and after pressing enter okay the next style will be my paragraph let's see enter so I have my first paragraph and the text is aligned justify and we have everything like before very nice we have seen how to create a new style now let's discuss about how to update that for example I don't like this is update tool and here this is update tool I don't like heading 1 it's too much 22 I want 16 and I want to update you can see 
this also was updated. I want to change the line spacing to be smaller, to be one. Update and it change everywhere. Let's change something from here. I change the distance so now the space now uh, everything change. Let's change heading to. I change heading to here but you can see below is not changed so I have to update that. Go, please um, click here and everything will be changed. I want another size. Click here update everything changed. Very easy to use. My paragraph I want to be another color, another size. Okay, I want 11 and I want another color. I want 10 and let's change the color. I want this gray. Okay, so I select this and update from here. All the text is updated. Everything is the same. Okay. Very easy to use this uh, tool here. So let's talk about this uh, new style. Um, let's suppose I have this row here. This is a new style, a new paragraph. Okay. I want this text to be centered, another font, another size, italic, let's change, I don't want underline, I want to be italic. So this is what I want. From here I can go here new style from selection and I can create a new style my underline. If I am here in the middle, if I have some text and I want to be underlined, I, very easy, I have that. I can modify I can have some space because it's too small. Now it looks much better. So we talk about new style, we talk about updated. Let's talk about load styles. Let's close this document. This is named first document. It's here. Let's create a new document. And we don't have any custom style here because we don't have yet. We have to load that from file. We choose the file and you can see I have now all the headings and the styles from the previous uh, document. Let's uh, enter some text. Double click. Enter. I have the new uh, heading. After pressing enter I will have the normal text. And if I want uh, something italic, I want some italic text. Okay, so double click here and it's italic. Another chapter here, double click, it's chapter. Pressing enter, it's a uh, heading two. Okay, so very easy to use, very easy in documents after documents. So you can import that styles from a document, you can delete that styles, update that styles, create them, everything you need uh, you can do from here. New styles, update styles, load styles. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more video about LibreOffice uh, every week. Thank you.